How y'all doing today? It's TK Smith Jr. Message from my heart to you. All right, y'all. Let's get into this. Look, I'm going to tell you like this. Stop blocking your blessings. Okay? It's a lot of people out here, they blocking their blessings right now. You know, they, there's something in front of them right now they need to jump on. Something that's going to help them get to the next level. Something that's gonna, they're going to put a little bit of effort into. There's something out here that's right there in front of you right now that was given to you as an opportunity, but you ain't jump on to because you ain't want to because you was too stuck in your emotions, too stuck in your feelings. And you said, I don't want no part of this blessing. See, see, if it's something that's going to change your life, something that's going to give you an opportunity to help change your life, and it is something that's positive and that you will feel comfortable doing because it's something that's in you to do, then you need to go for it. Maybe it might be a another level up, but you're supposed to go up levels in life. You're not going to stay at the same stage and always feel like life is not meant for you and, you know, life is just here to beat you down and life is just supposed to make you feel like you're stuck in quicksand and you're just sinking in, you're just slowly sinking. You're not supposed to feel like that. See, God, he, well, he's, his hand is out and he wants us all to grab it and pull on it. And that's what I'm going to ask you to do. Once you grab on the opportunity and the blessing that he's trying to give you, stop blocking it. Open your hand and grab it. Stop blocking it. I want you to go for it. I want you to think right now, like, you know what? Do I go for what's in my heart? Do I do I go for the blessing that he's trying to give me? Do I do I put the time and effort or do I make up excuses like, oh, I don't have the time to do it. I'm too tired. Oh, man, I'll get to it tomorrow. Let me just sit on here and be on social media and waste four hours looking at other people's lives and admiring who they are and then so I can get away from my own self and how my look at myself. I want to admire other people's dreams and their purpose and stuff. See, they jumped on the opportunity. They jumped on, you know, opportunity that God has given them their blessing. They didn't block it. See, you need to sit here and look at it as, you know what, I, I can get to where they at. Because, see, they jumped on a blessing. And that's why I'm admiring their life. I want to follow their life. I want to know about their life. Because they jumped on something that I can jump on, too. I'm not trying to tell you to be a movie star or something like that or some big person. Is where I'm trying to tell you that... We all are given blessings that we need to grab on and hold and run with. But when we do not, we stand still in the same spot that we are in today, tomorrow, next month, next year. And we need to keep it moving. We need to stay productive. We need to push ourselves to want more out of ourselves and more out of life. We gotta push ourselves, and God has given us all these tools for us to get to where we need to get to. And how dare we sit here and say this is where He wants us to be for the rest of our lives? Our purpose is supposed to touch other people. Our purpose is supposed to affect people's lives. And we're not gonna do it if we keep blocking the blessings and opportunities that He's given us. So I'm gonna tell you like this: Get off your high horse. Get down there and grab that blessing and walk forward. And don't block it. Don't say you don't deserve it. You got to put the effort in. I feel like God gives us the blessing, but he wants us to go after it. He wants us to help it grow. He don't, he's just not going to do all the work. So if you're sitting here venting about your life right now, you've been about your life yesterday, you've been all the time about where you at and how you don't like where you at. You need to sit here and build a plan. You need to sit here and think about God and his blessing that he's trying to give you. And you need to sit here and put take all these thoughts that he's putting in your mind and work on all of them because those are blessings too. Those thoughts are a blessing. Those thoughts are our, our direction. Don't shun them. Accept them and run with them and go with them and keep them built. That's the blessings all around us in our mind in front of us through other people we're, we're being blessed but we're not we're not seeing it we're not focused on them we just want to stay where we at I'm gonna tell you like this I need you to stop it stop blocking your blessings so that's my message from me to you from a hawk all right y'all you know where I gotta leave you all with I wish you to love yourself remember this is our what we're gonna come on y'all claim it Always and forever stay in coverage. And all my LLPs out there living life's purpose, I want you to keep going hard for your purpose. I want you to keep going forward. I want you to share your purpose with the world. I want you to help someone else get to their purpose. I want you to inspire someone else. I want you to reach out to someone else and tell them, you know, you're going to get it. So you know what? Let's get it together. We on a purpose journey together, y'all. So, hey, I don't want nobody out there slacking. I don't want nobody out there quitting. We don't queue 
U I T. We don't do that over here, okay? So we're gonna keep going. This is our community because it's all purpose driven. Because I want everybody to reach your purpose. So I want you to keep it up and keep going. All right, y'all. Don't block your blessings, okay? I want you to move forward, so keep moving forward. All right, TK Smith Jr., I'm gonna check y'all out next time, all right?